this video we would see how to draw another beautiful A4 sized mandala. Here five circles are there and the radius is 1.5, 2, 3, 6, 10. We need totally six divisions, three in one part of the circle, three in another part. So we are going to mark degrees every 60. So starts with 0, 60, 120, 180, 240, 300, 360 and 0 falls at the same place. I have connected the dots. There are six subdivisions now, three here and three here. Let's start drawing the patterns. In the first circle, this is the pattern that I am making. Simple leaves. So this circle is complete. Now I am drawing a very simple pattern in the next circle too. Three petals in every grid. This is how it looks once you complete the second circle. And in the third circle, See look, I am taking any two grids and here in this grid, this is the pattern that I am going to draw. I am leaving the center petal here. This is how I am going to fill in the third circle now. So once you finish, this is how it looks like. Now let us focus on the next circle. What I am doing here is to draw a sharp petal. So first to complete the six sharp petals and then I will tell you what to do in between any two. So once you complete the sharp petals, it looks like this. Now in between these two, any two petals, we would draw two small arcs and draw one more arc and at the top of this arc, we would draw sharp and thin petals like this so one in the center four on either side so maybe something like that we can do and then maintain consistency so totally nine petals here so here in the side what i'm planning to do is to paint it in a plain color any plain color and then maybe lines on top of it in a contrasting color so this is how we are going to fill in the pattern between any two petals in this circle now the next pattern is take any two grids and just draw a curved petal like this and from the mid of the next grid somewhere like this draw three more we will have a four layered petal So fill in the entire circle like this first. In between any two petals here, so we would draw a simple pattern like this. And probably we may add one on either side of this. So like this we would complete the entire mandala. Once you finish the pattern, this is how the finally completed mandala would look like. You can now outline it and then draw some patterns inside or you can outline it and paint it also, however you like it. Thank you for watching.